Hey guys, today we're going to be taking a look at the Xiaomi Mi Wi-Fi Repeater 2. There's a 2. It's a sequel. Hi, I'm Steve and today on Southfall Drones we're going to be taking a look at the Xiaomi Mi Wi-Fi Repeater 2. It's a 300 megabits per second, 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi transmitter um, and signal booster. Uh, it's got two PCB antennas inside for a widespread signal delivery and reception um, around your home or as I use it uh, in the field. But you could connect this through your laptop to hotspots uh, while you're out and about and it will give you a much more reliable signal and a longer range signal. Um, but the main reason I got it is to boost the FPV signal on small drones. Um, there's nothing worse than losing visual uh, FPV signal at 60 meters or so um, when your drone's got a range of 200 meters and just as you lose signal you see that large light pole looming in front of your drone or that small child's face as they step out of the bushes in fr front of your drone uh, leaving you to wonder whether you could use the force to fly it out of danger or perhaps uh, convince the parents that rotor blades in the forehead is quite a good look for their daughter. Uh, the reason I got it is, is, as I say, mainly to boost the signal, but it does work well around your home. Um, it's got a, a handy cover for the uh, slightly extended USB connection there. Uh, it's got an angle so that once you plug it into your power pack or your laptop, you can angle it. And when you take this in the field, you angle it towards the area you're flying your drone in uh, just to make sure that uh, you maximize the signal. Um, it feels nice and it's it's pretty pretty strong and tough. I've had this a while now and it, it's it's not even uh, got a crack or anything on it. I have dropped it a few times, but um, no, it's it's pretty strong. The, the clasp still locks on, doesn't go anywhere. Um, and yeah, a reliable piece of kit. So we'll show you how to connect uh, the me uh, repeater to your phone um, and then to your drone. And here we see the Mi Home app in its natural environment, the Google Play Store. Just type Mi Home and it's the first one that comes up, green square. Take that one and install it. Yeah, even my awful Motorola will install this pretty quickly. It's about 26 megs, I think, something like that. I'll put the number up on the screen. Uh, accept and sign your life away with permissions. Install the app and then we can get going. You will have to set up um, a free account with Mi Home. Um, it's just like a, a login system. That's easy enough done. Um, you can select your home country for that, but for the installation, which you'll see in a moment, uh, there you go, press on the button, accept continue. You must select mainland China as your, as your home address. Doesn't matter whether you live in England or Colombia, you must select mainland China and then you'll come to this screen, hit the login at the top, sign in, and then it'll ask you for your details. If you've, once you set up your, your own personal account, um, you come back to this screen and then you hit the little password button at the bottom. That'll allow you to put in your email address and password. Uh, so go ahead and do that, put in your details, and then it'll bring you to this screen, click add device, and then go down to the bottom and click add manually. Now, if you didn't select mainland China, none of these uh, items will be coming up at all and it won't display the Wi-Fi repeater. All right, so it's asking us to reset the Wi-Fi repeater. So we pick up a nice paper clip or a safety pin or a, a board pin, a drawing pin of some description, and you need to put it in the, the little hole under the light there, just for hold it in there for about three seconds. The light will then go out and then it will go solid. There we go, right. That's it reset, ready to go. So if you press how to reset, it will then say reset successfully. And we're then gonna press that again in a second to start scanning, but we need to power up the cord, put a battery in there and turn on the FPV. All right, so we've plugged in the Wi-Fi repeater and we're gonna add device. Make sure I am recording, I am recording. Wi-Fi repeater. 
that always doesn't doesn't always come up so add manually at the bottom there if you have to then you select the Wi-Fi that you want to connect to there it is Wi-Fi UFO that's the one coming from the drone click on that one now it's grayed out because uh, it can't connect to the uh, internet through that device but that's fine we don't want to next there is no password Come on, awful motor roller. There we go. Right, so that will go through. Now, it will connect. Uh, when, when it's connected, the light will go blue. So we'll see. Maybe you can see that there. I'm flashing orange at the moment. But that will go blue once it's connected to the drone. Now, it'll still try to connect to the internet, so it'll still search. But um, that that's not a problem for us. We're not interested in the internet. I mean, the connection to the drone. Can take a minute or two. Okay, there's the blue line. Can you see that? Excellent. So we're connected to the drone and the Wi-Fi repeat remembers the drone. Um, that'll continue uh, on up to 100% and it'll tell you it's a fail. Do you want to retry? Don't retry, you don't need to. The Wi-Fi repeat is connected to the drone. So what did I think of the Xiaomi Mi Wi-Fi repeater 2? It's great, it does exactly what it says on the tin. It's uh, reliable, it's hard wearing, and it's cheap. It costs uh, $12.99 on Amazon. Go and check it out and get yourself a bargain. I didn't have time to do a range test because the weather out here has been pretty, pretty poor uh, recently. But if you wanna see some range tests done with the, my, uh, with the repeater, go and see Quadcopter 101 on YouTube he is a brilliant reviewer absolutely fantastic and he's done several reviews using the uh, repeater too and all very successful so yeah if you want to see some range tests check out quadcopter one check out quadcopter 101 anyway he's absolutely outstanding subscribe um, thanks for watching guys I've been Steve for Southport drones fly safe